So now there are six steps for risk assessment activity. What are these six steps? You understand all these six steps and you will ensure you will write all the questions on CISA exam on this concept correctly. So what are these six steps? First one is understand the business environment. It is the basic requirement of any risk assessment activity to understand the business environment. What is the second step? Identify the critical assets. So next, once you are aware of the business environment, you need to identify the critical assets that support that particular business. Third one is identify all potential risks for that particular critical assets. You identify the business environment, you identify the assets that support that business environment, then you identify the risks that are applicable for that particular critical assets. Next one is now all risks cannot be that important because their impact may not be that much. So we need to prioritize the risks in order of its criticality. Fifth one. Now for each risk we can have multiple control mechanism. All mechanism may not be relevant in the term that cost of control should always be less than cost of risk. So we will need to evaluate all the available control mechanism. And then last we need to apply the relevant control. So again first step is to understand the business environment. You understand the critical assets that support that business environment. You identify the risks for the critical assets. You prioritize all the risk. You evaluate the control mechanism. And then which control mechanism is relevant, you apply that particular control mechanism. Thanks for watching. For more such videos, please visit datainfosec.blogspot.in. All the best for your CISA exam.